Welcome to Boomhauer 69's channel, and today we're going to talk about Sylvester Stallone, Rambo, First Blood, Part 2. Now, when it comes to the Rambo series of these movies, 1, 2, and 3, the kind of first ones, the ones from the 80s and 90s of the Rambo series, those are my favorite bits of the Rambo series. I've always been a fan of the kind of first ones, you know. And I'll show you here. Here's what the um, front looks like. There's Sylvester Stallone with his machine gun. And it says on the front here, No man, no law, no war can stop him. There's the sides of the VHS. This is my VHS copy. And there's him in his um, bow and arrow up in the tree. And I'll read what it says here. Rambo First Blood Part 2 is the explosive hit that established the Rambo as the ultimate action hero of the 80s in search of American POWs. John Rambo, John Rambo is sent on a secret and dangerous mission in Vietnam only to discover he's been double-crossed by his superiors. Armed with just his bow and arrow and knife, Rambo is left, left to, def to fend for himself in the fierce and hostile jungles, beating the very deadly odds of this dynamo vows to take revenge on those who double-crossed him. Some Richard Karina co-stars in, in the phenomenon that is a must for action fans. And it says here, POW sent secret dangerous mission via. It takes place in Vietnam. Like, it's supposed to be like Vietnam's over and John Rambo is sent on a mission to retrieve POWs that were left behind in Vietnam from my understanding. And I watched this video. I love it. If you like movies with a lot of action in it, a lot of fights and combat scenes, one of the scenes I like the most is where um, Rambo gets a hold of a a enemy helicopter and he and he flies over the the base where the POWs are at, over the um, enemy's military base where they got the POWs captured, and he's blowing everything up the smithereens. And then he's got all the POWs in in the helicopter. They're up in the air, and, the, and he's having a, a helicopter fight with the other enemy that's got a helicopter, you know. I believe it's Russians. The Russians got a helicopter following him, trying to shoot shoot his helicopter down, and Rambo's trying to fight him off. And then there's the one part where... Where the guy thinks Rambo had crash landed, so he's gonna finally the enemy's gonna finally blow up the helicopter, and Rambo hurries up and takes a rocket launcher and and blows the helicopter to smithereens, you know, blows it to smithereens, and that and it's just an awesome video. If you're one of those, it's a rated R movie because there's a lot of blood and goriness to it, and if you really like movies like this with a lot of fighting and action scenes. I highly recommend watching this if you haven't seen it already. You know, it's a great movie. I really enjoyed it, you know. I'll show you again here the VHS. And there's if you got on VH if you find it on VHS this is what it's gonna look like. You know, I really love Sylvester Simone. I think he's a great actor. I think this movie is great. I like how Sylvester Simone plays this kind of quiet, like dark shy guy kind of person like that has like this black dark spirit you know he's just kind of quiet and this and this kind of voice how he is you know like there's where this he's got on here this little necklace course thingy this there's some Viet Cong lady that's helping Rambo get to this base and stuff that's working for him she ends up getting hurt and so he takes a lucky she ends up getting killed, so he keeps the necklace as a memory keepsake of, of her to rem remember her in her memory. And she, um, and when he has a, he asks her what, what that necklace was all about, and she says, a lucky charm. 
and he, and and so he's like, oh, and and then she asks him what he had for lucky charm, and he holds up this big old knife, and he's like, well, I guess this is my my lucky charm, you know, like and and stuff, and so and that's a great scene too, and. And I just love this movie. I could sit there and talk about it for hours on end and make a huge long video. But again, it's a great video. It's it's 95 minutes long. The approximate running time is 95 minutes is what it says on here. So yeah, it's about an hour long video. But it's well worth the watch, you know. Get you some popcorn, make it and some friends and watch and highly watch this video because I highly recommend it. That's a great movie all around. But yeah, if you like more of these kind of videos, feel free to subscribe to the channel. I'm going to be doing more videos on things that I like and dislike and, and stuff. And, and even more videos about movies that I've seen that I like and what I think about them. And again, I think Sylvester Stallone is a great actor all around. And I think this is, again, the first three the ones from the 80s and 90s of the Rambo series, I think, are the best. And nothing, nothing's going to beat them. I say the other Rambos that I've seen, because I've seen the newer ones. I just haven't, i got to rewatch those to freshen my memory on those. But still, I say even the newer ones will never beat the original classics. You know, nothing's going to beat the original classics, no matter what. And definitely like them. And again, if you like this sort of content... You know, subscribe to my channel. I'm going to be doing more. And comment below what you thought of the Rambo series. What was your favorite parts? Parts of the movie, you know. One of my favorite scenes is him flying around in the helicopter. In the helicopter fight scene. And him kind of blowing up. And then also seeing him numerous times with the bow and arrow, you know, being real accurate and stuff. You know, I think that's great, you know. you seeing him use a bow and arrow as... As the choice of weapon in this movie. So yeah. And thank you for taking the time to watch this video. And I hope you all have a good day.